Now to Alabama and a story that sounds like the plot from a movie of the week. The FBI has joined the manhunt for an escaped prison inmate and a corrections officer who they say helped him with the jailbreak. Here's CBS's Janet Chamlian. Tonight, an Alabama sheriff searching for an escaped capital murder suspect says one of his own corrections officers, Vicki White, was in on it. We have had a warrant issued for Director Vicki White. The charges are permitting or facilitating an escape in the first degree. White claims she was driving inmate Casey White, no relation, from the jail to a courthouse mental health evaluation on Friday, then going to a medical appointment herself. The sheriff now says neither statement was true. And taking a prisoner without a second deputy was a violation of policy. Her patrol car was found in a shopping center parking lot later that day. The patrol car left the detention center and went straight to the parking lot. There was not enough time for them to even attempt to try to come to the courthouse. This is Casey White last week inside the jail where he was being held on charges of capital murder, six foot nine and 260 pounds. He was put into the patrol car, handcuffed and shackled. We've gotten some, uh, a couple of tips on, on a possible vehicle. We're still pursuing that, trying to get a, a positive uh, confirmation on a, on a possible vehicle they switched into. 56-year-old Vicki White has been with the department almost 17 years, several times named Employee of the Year. The widow, who had no children, submitted retirement papers Thursday. Friday was to be her last day. She did sell her home about a month ago and uh, talked about going to the beach. Everybody thought she was going to retire. Right. You know, nobody saw this coming. Vicki White's mom says her daughter never mentioned Casey White, who's only been in that jail since the end of February. Authorities are now reviewing videos from inside to determine the nature of the relationship. Nora. Quite a story. Janet Chamlian, thank you.